although quite dead, he hasn't lost his spirit and wishes to high-five everybody. Now that's a positive attitude, if you ask me. Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Owl Detects Glitches. This time we are back with Days Gone, as it's been a while since we last visited Deacon and the gang in their crude post-apocalyptic surroundings. As usual, be prepared for 10 examples filled with tons of memes and movie references. Sit tight and enjoy. My name is Alu, I'm a glitch hunter, and this is Days Gone Bugs and Glitches Compilation Part 3. There is a theory that two objects can't occupy the same place at the same time. Well now, I guess the creators of Days Gone while making the game may have skipped this rule slash law slash principle slash theory, among some others. Or maybe they are just fans of the Warcraft universe. I can definitely see resemblance here. Okay, I know dead bodies end up underground this way or another, but, but this is ridiculous. Or wait, maybe Deacon is actually an X-Men and has similar powers to Kitty Pride, Or maybe even Apocalypse himself. That's a game-changing moment. Breakers. Ugh, I remember when the first time I saw one, I almost shat my pants. The growl they make, the amount of damage they can take before falling. One breaker is a tough cookie to crumble. So, in this situation, I'm fighting too. No stress at all. Mm -mm. Actually, you can admire my extra human dodging skill here. Damn, I'm good. And it was only the last one that managed to hit me. But I quickly repaid him in kind. In case you missed what just happened, here's a slow-mo. Here's a hit in the air, the sound, and the guy dies two meters away from me. Yeah, you better don't mess with Deacon St. Andrews, St. Peter, St. John, me. Oh, come on, man. Okay, this one may not be as flashy and as marvelous as many other glitches I have, but in this case, it is the time the main character takes to fulfill the action, started by pressing the square button. It's okay, there is no rush, I have time, plenty of it. Mm -hmm. Fifteen seconds. Fifteen seconds. You know what I can do in fifteen seconds? I can... No, let's not go there. When slaughtering huge amounts of freakers, some of the bodies tend to fall and freeze in the most ridiculous and abnormal positions. Sometimes they just look like mannequins that have been tipped over but still posing as nothing happened. And then there is this guy. Although quite dead, he hasn't lost his spirit and wishes to high-five everybody. Now that's a positive attitude, if you ask me. I request the highest of fives. This is a curious one, but requires at least an eagle eye to spot it or basically being... me. Your friendly neighborhood, Alu the Glitch Hunter. During this mission, Deacon gets stripped from all his equipment. Then... We pick his stuff up, but weirdly without ammo. In addition, the mission forces us to do it in stealth mode. Check out what happens when I want to switch to the pistol. It clearly shows that I haven't got any ammo in my assault rifle, nor in my sniper rifle, but it shows 10 bullets loaded in the pistol with additional 19 spare bullets. But when I actually choose the gun, it shows 0 slash 0 bullets. And when I open the wheel again, it now shows zero bullets as well. Where have all my 19 bullets gone? But why are the bullets gone? 
Ah uh, yes, the classic case of I'm so afraid that I will start running but won't move an inch. I sometimes call this a running man. No, no, not this one. This particular case happened during clearing one of the camps. Pay attention to this guy over here. Thankfully he is marked and I may lose him from sight here and there, but trust me it's the same enemy. And since he's marked, let's just call him Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. So, here we can see Mark stuck in a spot, running his lungs out. I deliberately decided to spare Mark for now, as I wanted to check for how long he can be running like that. As you can see, Mark is still doing his thing, good old boy. Finally, when I got too close to him, the spell has been broken. Dobby is free. But Mark, what the hell are you doing? Why are you shooting at me? I would never... Yeah, I killed him in the end. What is a glitch compilation without the awkwardness of the meat harvesting glitch? So on my way from one quest to another, I bumped into some dead deer. But this one... Like, which physics laws apply here, I wonder? He looks like somebody cast a petrification spell on him. I can only guess how fun the whole animation of the meat harvesting will look like. One thing I must say... Although Deacon had a deer leg going through his chest, his mouth was still moving while saying the dialogue. So, kudos for that. And let's have a look at the other deer. See, this is how a normal dead deer should look like. And another classic here, the levitating object. You know, bears are quite tough opponents in Days Gone. Bullet sponges, so to speak. You use every means necessary to take the mother flocker down, including shooting them with a crossbow. And as in any good game, Days Gone has a crossbow bolt retrieval mechanics, meaning you can retrieve the bolts from the opponent bodies and reuse them. This seems quite logical, right? Logical. The problem starts when you don't retrieve the bolt from the body, but from air? The behavior is highly illogical. Okay, remember from the previous Days Gone Glitches compilation video when Deacon started a radio conversation with Ricky and I rushed towards her as I was close to check if she was actually using a radio and she was not in a single way involved in the conversation, making the radio chat sound like it had been pre-recorded. This one is a bit more hilarious, I think. It all began with me stupidly dying from my own explosive. I am blame it on the heat of the battle. And get respawned from the save point, which happened to be next to Captain Corey. And guess what happens? Yes, one of the radio conversations starts with... Corey, while standing next to him. And again, the character is not involved in this conversation whatsoever. In the previous example, with Ricky, it was just, you know, bad timing plus my curiosity. But here, when the game spawns me next to a person and starts the radio conversation with that person... Yes, sir. Thanks for watching guys, be sure to check my other videos from Days Gone and many other games. Additionally, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Till next glitch, ta-ta!